like stunning, I like shining, I like Yo D squad, it's your girl Apple back at it again with a back at it again. So guys, today I'm gonna be doing a different video. I'm gonna be doing a skincare routine. Yes, people, I know, it's about time. I know there are a lot of people that have been asking me, girl, skincare routine, skincare routine, makeup routine, skincare routine. Girl, I got you. I got y'all. Okay, I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it all if I have to. So I'm gonna be showing you a simple way that I keep my face flawless. First off, before I start, I just want to put out a disclaimer, guys. Listen, when my skin, right? Never used to be like this. But the thing is, it also comes to genetics when you talk about your skin. You know, is your family known to have pimples, acne, you know, what what you put on your face. What I put on my face might not work for your face because you might have oily skin, dry skin, skin that is mixed. Here is oily, there is dry, you know, that type of skin. So, I'm going to start with my touch mask. It's a Balea product. It looks like this. It's a Balea product. I already opened it already. Um, I love to prepare it already. I love to open it already so that it can just get that type of thing in. But first off, I'm gonna go in with my peeling gel. It's a type of scrub, but it's not really like rough on the skin. It's really good. I think I should tie my hair. I should have done that in the beginning. So I really like to, I think in my makeup video, you guys saw how I remove my makeup and you no know, moisturize my skin, the type of um, products that I use to remove my makeup. Because um, I learned from uh, Kris Jenner, she's the Kardashian's mom. Um, she says once you start wearing makeup, you have to you have to start taking care of your skin because when you start wearing makeup you need to take more like more care of your skin and it needs to be in tip top shape so I just tied my hair and I rinsed off the peeling gel I like to use a cotton to dry my face because I noticed that I get really sensitive to like like towel face towels and it just makes my face drier and I feel like the cotton just you know remove the water but it just doesn't make your face dry I don't know if that sounds um, about right <laughs> After that, I use the wash gel Balea. It is uh, made out of it is ha it a little, little sorry. It has charcoal and other nutrients for the face and vitamins as well. I love to use it, um, you know, because it's really good for the skin. After I use it, my skin becomes soft and luscious. Um, it's for for. I think the only reason why I started doing face routines and taking care, care taking care taking care of my skin is because I wear makeup, you know? Um cuz my skin is still young and it's still fresh and you know, I shouldn't be going over it with different type of products. But I wear makeup, so I need to start um, taking care of my skin, making sure that even if I put on makeup, um, it won't like give like bad consequences in the future. You know, I know how to take care of my skin with or without makeup. I think before I started putting on makeup, my I never used to take my skin. I never used to wash my face. Like every day, I would just do my face, wash my face in the shower when I wake up in the morning and, you know, go to bed, you know. But now, because I wear makeup, it's more important to take care of your skin. pop your pimples just leave them be 
you know because if you pop your pimples and not professionally you will leave blemishes because there are oils in your pimple so when you pop and the, some oils are left in there they can turn into blemishes and people are like yeah i have blemishes in my skin how do i change that stop popping your pimples stop it it's so annoying when i see people like do you know you're the cause <laughs> of your acne like don't it was a toner a garnier toner i love toners it's really good for my skin especially um after i remove my makeup hmm that is when i'm like toner where are you you know because i love the toner it just tones your face and relaxes your face and it's just so smooth so i just by the way it's a product of ganya i just put it on a cotton pad and then put it on after that i just like to touch it even though i'm not supposed to i just like to pat it into my skin so that I can just get in there. It's almost like a soap. So you can see some white bubbles there of foam. So I just like to get in there. I'm like tired of wearing makeup and I'm just not in the mood to wear makeup. I just wash my face, go through the skincare routine, and it's done. So now I'm gonna I'm gonna put on the mask. And after you remove mm -hmm. After you you remove um hold on <laughs> I look like a ghost I just like it because it has this beautiful um things inside it like products that helps with the skin smooth the skin especially if i'm going out and i don't want to wear makeup i would just put on the face mask i have a lot of these so like you know i love to ex experiment with i just let it dry a bit like i'm coming in ah! no i'm like i'm like a rubber i'm not rubber actually it's just a face mask oh really okay go on now <laughs> yeah yeah so once it's done oh beautiful i think you guys can see it it leaves my skin ah i just love it and then i just smooth them out the, like this just smooth it out and it's just amazing and I hate to share uh, face products. I really hate that because, you know, it's on my Nova oil, it has all the oils and it's really good for my skin. I already put it on because my camera went off. So, yeah. And then after I do that, I put on Vaseline on my lips. I don't really use like lip scrubs and stuff like that. You know so just avoid people touching your face and if you have oily skin dry skin just use products of all skin types and thank you for listening to my video about skin i mean psh, skin what about skin skin is good drink lots of water stay hydrated because as much as people hate drinking water that is the one number one thing that really keeps your skin good looking and you know eat healthy avoid junk food especially chocolate chocolate i heard chocolate is not good for your skin google it i might be wrong i might be right who knows but anyway don't forget to like subscribe and comment down below if you're new and i love you guys peace